so here's my Ikea hack right here. This, um, whoop, this chest of drawers right here, not this drawer here. This chest of drawers comes from Ikea. It's the Mopi, I don't know if I'm saying that right in Swedish. Um, it was about 20 bucks and I just needed a place to store like my extra glue sticks and um, tape and distress inks. And I got a set of wax seals for Christmas. So I had all these like little random bits that I needed um, storage and I didn't want plastic bins. So I thought this would be a little, a, a little bit cuter. So um, it's just an inexpensive, unfinished birch um, chest of drawers when you first get it. This is this is what it looks like when you um, get it unfinished. And actually the drawers, this is um, the way the drawers uh, face out um, with a finger pull to open them. So what I did was spray painted. Actually, I painted all of it with chalk paint first. And then I thought I might get like finger smudges and stuff on it um, because this is like my paint and craft center here. So I wound up spraying it with um, this satin paint in heirloom white. It's kind of like a like a cottage white. Um, and I turned all the uh, drawers around and I had my son drill holes for me. And then I purchased these knobs from an Etsy seller and I'll put the link below because I wanted that sort of like um, bohemian vintage vibe. I was actually going to do assorted different colored knobs and I still might do that with another set, you know, another um, chest of drawers, but I, I don't know. I saw these knobs and I really like them. It's you know, one of my favorite colors, sort of that um, emerald teal with little accents of gold. They're just super pretty. Um, and can we take a moment to appreciate my adorable little macrame hammock that I found and I picked up an air plant and I'm hoping I'm not going to kill it. <laughs> um... Yeah, so let me uh, take the drawers out and I'll, I'll show you a little bit what's inside. Okay, so in here, I just keep some Distress Ink, some more stamp pads, and this was the wax set that I received from um, my son and his girlfriend for Christmas. And the melting pot and spoon, because I was old school using a, a Bic lighter and some wax sticks, which works. Um, and they got me a few extra um, wax seal uh, stamps and handles. And yeah, it's really fun to play with. So a lot easier than <laughs> using the old um, Bic lighter method. And this is the one of the small drawers from up, up top. That's just an extra, extra glue that I just purchased, some tape runner refills and uh, glue sticks. I buy these at Blick. They're like a buck and they work great. So now I'm gonna step down off this chair. So that's it. That's my little DIY Ikea hack. I hope you guys liked it. Thanks so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Thanks, bye.